Okay, we're back. 1986, Cobra, Night Raven, G.I. Joe, Real American Hero. Um, I've been working on this for like two years, and I was getting along pretty good. Well, first I got, I eyeballed, I've been eyeballing this ship, and I hem hauled about it. Well, I did some trading with Scuba Pete. Well, I, I didn't really trade. I was just sending him some parts that he needed for a project. And he said we met up at his um, vendor vendor mall cabinet. And I'm like, is there anything in there you want? You can have it. No problem. He had a Night Raven. And I was like, I'll take a Night Raven. I was like, we're cool. And he's like, is there anything else? Is there anything else? And there's some other parts. And then I went back later and I bought a dish for Millennium Falcon. I didn't want to just take. I wanted to give something back. So I got the ship. And it came with some parts. Um, extra parts. Damaged parts. And like, luckily, he did keep all the little crumbs. But like, I had to do some learning, knowing that these tail fins are different. One has a refueler tip on it. I think I got, you know, this one, this one came with it, and it was missing the point of it, and I already had that side. I already had that side, but what I didn't know is that they were different, and I ordered a fin, and I got the same side. And I realized, well, they're different. So I done that. So I got a fin for it. And I think Joe Fest, I got a drone. Just as a placeholder. And I had to get some landing gear for it. Uh, I had... Yeah, see, there's even little crumbs... Luckily, he kept all the crumbs because I managed to glue the crumbs that I needed back. Um, I had landing gear, but the mounting was different. I don't know why I have two. One must have came with wheels, and one must have came without wheels. I had to get front landing gear for it, and all those little crumbs of plastic, I glued them on. Well, I mean, like, the first first weekend I had it, I had it up on its wheels. Well, it was on blocks, but I had the three-pack of wheels together. So it's like it was coming along. I had to get the uh, wing bombs for it. And it already had the uh, gun on the back. And I basically set, because I was looking, I needed a cockpit. I could never find a cockpit. And the drone needed the side, the wing guns. And I found a uh, drone. I think I, I found a drone at Joe Fest, and I had the wing guns. So I bought it for the wing guns. It was like five bucks. And I decided to use... No. I found... It didn't, it, there was no drone. I found this drone at Joe Fest. I bought this one on eBay because I had the wing guns and it was cheap. And this one was in better shape. So I switched the wing guns off this one and put them on that one. This one had stickers on it, but I was just looking. This one belongs on the uh, wing on the bottom. And then there's another sticker here and it's residue. Blue residue and there's some sort of wax or glue if I decided to go with this one but it's missing the tail cone so it's on hold it's been kind of in a pile a shame well recently because I kind of on hold on two two main parts one was the canopy I mean the uh, cockpit I found a cockpit for it 
and I snagged that thing right up. So that kind of fueled fueled my passion again. I need to get this thing working. I got the cockpit. I get the cockpit. I got a pilot, and I needed the uh, gun cover, and I found a gun cover, and it came with a pilot, and I wish I'd found it a week earlier, but I have two, two pilots. It's a two-seater, so I got one good shape, one's pretty beat, but they're both functioning and working and unbroke. So then, on the left was the tail cone for the drone. big box for just a tail cone. So that's what I had to do. I already cheated, I've been into this. This isn't a live unboxing. I got another drone. Hold on. I got another drone. It comes with a one wing gun. But it also comes with the exhaust. And it was cheaper buying this whole thing than just the tail cone. The tail cone was like 35 in shipping. This was like 25 Saved me 10 bucks. So now I have three drones. Now which one do I use? I already took this one apart. And I already cleaned it. And I put it back together. But... I'm probably going to have to take it apart again. Just to, if you want to see a uh, assembly, I can do that. Let's disassemble Stephanie. I'm going to take this gun, uh, wing gun off. Squeeze these. Squeeze those two together. And pull up here. Pretty... Uh, It's pretty, uh, it listens cooperative because you put it in the rear, you tip it in because there's a little, see that little notch, squeeze it in, um, clips, the wings just kind of separated a little bit, there's a clip at the nose, so just kind of hinge it up. There's the bottom token, and then there's tabs on the side. Just kind of pull it apart, so there's that much. And then the cover. Just kind of, it's just two, two nipples. Yeah, see. Okay, so I took it apart, gave it a wash. Now reassemble. Put the cover back on. It says two nipples. Shouldn't really have any trouble. There ain't nothing. They shouldn't. Those nipples are small enough. They're not going to snap off. I'm just kind of pushing in one end to start it. And then trying to bend it. I pushed it in pretty hard, but yeah, no problem. Said the cover logo on the nose is good. You have the cover logo on this side of the wing, good. Then the Night Raven logo. I'm pretty sure that's it. This one has a interior sticker, but I think. That one has an interior sticker, but it's in the wrong place. So I was like, do I want to take the uh, best of all the parts to make one? But they're all relatively in the same condition. So I'm going to use this one. Okay, I'm putting in the seat the seat. The hole is where the head will go. So you gotta remember that would be towards the front. 
and add these little notches on the side. Just kind of spread it apart. Spread it. That snaps in. Snaps in real good. They didn't even have this in together the right way whenever I took it apart. It wasn't clipped together right, so it came apart pretty easy, and it, the cockpit just fell out. Okay, it's kind of a pain, but I want to try yeah, this way. So the notches, see there's notches on the bottom, and it's smooth on top. Notches go like that. Notches. Is it notches? So it's down. So it's right way up. Right way up. Notches point up. The bottom of the ship. Yeah, that happens. It does not want to stay. But it's just, it sits in there. There's a, a, a lip. I'm going to put that behind that lip. And like I said, the, uh, the bottom, there's a lip there too to hold it in place. And that's nipped together. Uh oh. There's that much. Okay, we're back. So the clip in front, clip the front end, and then those two clips on either side, they clip in, they go through, and on the top. And then the wing gun. It kind of holds it all together. Notch in, put notch in the back, push it right through. Sandwich this whole thing together. I'm going to use this one. So that means, like this one. So it's a good placeholder. Pop the wing right out. I'm watching what I'm doing and making sure you can see what I'm doing too. Right. Complete drone. Complete drone. I'm not complete. Not Raven. So this is Primo Menace for me. Um, complete ship. Pilot, co-pilot. Gun cover, complete drone, flaps, complete missiles, two on each wing, two on the bomb bay. I'm happy. It's like I said, it took two years. There is one thing I was not expecting. I'll show you. I'm leaving that there. I'm showing you on these two drones. This was my... This was my placeholder drone. This was my drone that I got the guns off of. Okay. Alright. See here? I'll take a look at this drone. You see on the exhaust, how it's smoothie. You see that slot in the center is where it mounts onto the middle of the uh, night raven. That is smooth. You can look at this one. It has two little feetsies. Show you. Yeah, this one is smooth on the bottom. This one has two tabs that stick up. I was thinking, well, maybe whenever it sits on the Raven, it sits level. No, I'll show you. Let's see. This one has the feetsies. Solid. This one no feetsies. So if you slant it, it sits level. So this one's all cockeyed and wonky. And that one's sitting nice and level because it has those two little feetsies on the bottom. So I was looking and double looking and nine times out of the ten, it didn't have the feetsies on them. So this one doesn't have the feetsies, the tabs. So, I need to keep this one as a variant. I mean, it's like, this one was probably the original version. And then there's like, oh, that ship sits down. See, it sits down on this low point. It sits and wobbles. See, you 
know what I mean? This one has the two, has that long one still that protrudes. Then these other two feetsies to keep it level while was, if it needs to set on the ground. So it's not over. It's over, but it's not over. The mystery continues. So I have these tailing, tailing parts. They're both the uh, left side and some broken landing gear. And I have two extra drones. So that basically covers it. 1986 Cobra Night Raven complete. Um, man, I wanted to show you the landing gear, but I'm scared to. Working landing gear. lever and I have to push it left and then I got my fingers on the back so I can pull it down smooth as glass and then down is easy that's just down bring flaps Bombay door had been cooperating isn't right now. There, that's cooperating. So I gotta figure out a way to display this because I want to get it displayed. Stickers. There's no stickers on the ship. There's stickers on the missiles. There's stickers on the drone, which are correct. Stickers on the cockpit. Other than that, it's supposed to have that sticker on this wing and then there's another sticker on this side I think it's the cap uh, logo a uh, Cobra logo let's see I have the, the drone has a sticker on the roof cockpit but I think this sticker belongs on the Night Raven itself I like the sleek no stick, minimal sticker it's supposed to be yeah one there I think one on either side of the cockpit. And there's a some kind of one in the center. Um, the search continues, but as of right now, I'm tickled less. And I don't know what else to say. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Like the video, press the like button. You want to leave a comment? Leave a comment. I will read them. My notification. I have to look. It doesn't always let me know, but I look every once in a while.